Most people taking osteoporosis medications don't know this, but a new study just linked them to a serious eye condition. Today, we're gonna to talk about a side effect of bone medications that hasn't really made headlines yet, but it could seriously impact your vision. If you've ever taken Actinel, Fosamax, Boniva, or another bisphosphonate, you've probably heard of side effects like acid reflux or developing serious jaw problems. But there's a new 2025 study that's found that these medications can also raise the risk of developing acute ankle closure glaucoma, a serious vision-threatening condition that can come on suddenly and requires urgent treatment. To put this in perspective, imagine walking around not knowing that you're at twice the risk for a condition that could take your vision away in a matter of hours and no one warned you. In this video, I'll be talking about what acute angle closure glaucoma actually is, what this new research discovered, which medications carry the greatest risk, and what you can do to protect your eyes if you're considering taking or if you're already taking osteoporosis medications. This is information that I wish more people knew. So let's dive in and have a look at it together. Hello, my friends. I'm Sarah, and I'm a nutritional health coach through the Institute for Integrative Nutrition. I'm also a BoneFit certified fitness instructor and a 500 hour trained yoga teacher with additional training that's specific to osteoporosis and yoga. I'm on a mission to reduce the number of osteoporotic fractures that happen each year and I am so pleased to have you join me in the journey to better bone health. So first off, what is acute angle closure glaucoma? Its name sounds complicated but the idea is easier to understand than you might think. Take a moment and imagine your eye like it's at the kitchen sink. There's fluid inside the front of your eye that's called the aqueous humor. It flows in, does its job of nourishing the eye, and then it drains out, kind of like running water down the sink. But what happens if the drain suddenly gets clogged? The water starts to back up, pressure builds quickly, and unless the clog is cleared, you'll end up with a clogged mess. This is what happens when someone develops acute angle closure glaucoma. The drainage angle in the eye where the fluid is supposed to exit suddenly closes off, and that causes a rapid spike in eye pressure. This is not the slow kind of glaucoma that creeps up over time. This is an emergency. When pressure rises quickly like that, it can damage your optic nerve, the part of your eye that sends images to your brain. And if it's not treated right away, then it can lead to having permanent vision loss. Given how serious this can be, here's a list of symptoms to keep an eye out for. Sudden blurry vision eye pain, seeing halos around lights, headaches, or even nausea or vomiting. So if you're on a bisphosphonate medication and you ever notice these symptoms, don't wait. Go straight to an emergency eye doctor or just to the emergency room at the hospital. So now that you know what acute angle closure glaucoma is and how serious it can be, Let's talk about the new study that raised the alarm for people that are taking osteoporosis medications. So researchers looked at the medical records of over 208,000 patients in the US who are being treated for osteoporosis between 2008 and 2018. What they found was surprising and important. Patients who took oral bisphosphonates like Fosamax, Boniva, and especially Actinel, had a significantly higher risk for developing acute angle closure glaucoma compared to the people who weren't taking these medications. In fact, for people taking Actinel specifically, the risk more than doubled. Actinel users had twice the risk of acute glaucoma. That's not small, and it's not something that most doctors are talking about yet. It's important to be clear here. The study didn't find any increased risk for the more common open angle glaucoma, which develops slowly over time. This was specific for the acute form that comes on suddenly and needs immediate medical treatment. So while this isn't a reason to panic, it is a reason to be informed. 
especially if you've ever experienced eye pain, blurry vision, or halos around lights after having started a bone medication. It's important to note that the study didn't consider intravenous bisphosphonates like Reclast, but researchers suggested that it's highly likely that intravenous bisphosphonates also increase the risk for developing acute angle closure glaucoma. So what should you do if you're taking one of these medications or if you're considering starting one? Know that this is a rare but serious side effect. It's something to be aware of and to talk to your doctor about. You deserve to be informed and you need to be proactive about your health. But at your next eye exam, especially if you're 50 or older, ask your ophthalmologist or your optometrist to check the drainage angles in your eyes. Some people naturally have narrow angles and they don't know it until something like medication tips the balance for them. So this is a quick and painless test and it can tell you whether or not you might be at higher risk for developing this. If you're concerned about your risk, bring this study to your next doctor appointment and ask your medical practitioner the following questions. Am I a good candidate for this medication? Are there any alternatives that might carry a lower risk for me? Would it make sense to see an eye doctor before continuing this prescription? Have you ever had an eye exam where they checked your ankles? Let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear about your experience. There are also other treatment options for osteoporosis that include different types of medication, including other bisphosphonates with a lower risk than actinel, prolia if you're considering a long-term medication option, bone building medications like Timlos, Forteo, and Avenity, or even hormone replacement therapy. This is a new study that's just been published in 2025, and it's likely that your doctor doesn't even know about it yet. So share this study with your doctor. It's essential to advocate for yourself. You have every right to ask questions, to explore options, and to seek second opinions. You're not being difficult when you ask questions. You're being wise. This is your body, your eyesight, your bone health, and your long-term overall health. I created this channel to help you to make more confident and informed decisions about your bone health. It's easy to feel overwhelmed when new information like this comes out, especially when it involves something as important as your vision and your bones. The thing to keep in mind is that knowledge is power. Now that you know what acute angle closure glaucoma is, which medications carry the highest risk and what signs and symptoms to watch out for, you also know what the right questions to ask are and what the steps to take with your doctor and your eye care team. You're not powerless, you're informed. I hope that this information helps you to ask questions and to make decisions from a place of clarity and confidence. And if you found this video helpful, please share it with a friend or a loved one who's taking osteoporosis medication or considering taking it. It just might help them to protect their sight and their bones at the same time. In the description for this video, you'll find a link to the study if you'd like to explore it further and on your own. And on that note, I look forward to talking with you soon.